Hey guys, Nash here. So I have something very new today. If you're bored with stock Android and if you don't want to install those boring ROMs, then you can install this Oxygen OS port. That also McLaren edition. So this port will install the same software that you get in OnePlus 7 Pro. As you can see, I have installed this in my three year old smartphone. That also not from OnePlus. So now I can use superior Oxygen OS from OnePlus for free. You don't need to buy OnePlus phone for that. So in this video, we are going to cover its performance, stability, whether you should install it or not, and also how to install this in your phone. So let's get started. So this is not the normal Oxygen OS board. This is Oxygen OS McLaren edition. So as you can see in the about section, all the hardware specs are for my phone, which is Redmi Note 7 Pro, but all the other things are ported from OnePlus 7 Pro. So the Oxygen OS version is open beta 18, which is based on Android 10. Now, if you don't want to move to Android 11, stay on this one. It's completely stable and I haven't found any bugs so far. And that's the reason Oxygen OS ports are most popular ports out there because they run stable on other phones too. Like on my Redmi phone, this OnePlus software is running like it was designed for my phone. And that's the reason I have been using this for the last 7 days. So as you can see now my device has completely transformed into OnePlus device. I got OnePlus launcher, OnePlus icon, the setting menu is from OnePlus. In the utilities, you can see this is parallel apps, you can lock your apps. From the home screen when you swipe like this, you enter into hidden space where you can hide your educational apps and many more. All the good things that you get with Oxygen OS, you will get in this port. And one more thing, if you are into mobile gaming, if you play games like PUBG, Call of Duty, then this room is really good for gaming. For some reason, if you don't like one of the base gaming rooms like Chorus OS or Nacentra OS, then you can use this Oxygen OS for your gaming purpose, as this is a hardcore gaming room too. And the reason you get amazing gaming performance because this room comes with pre-installed gaming kernel. In the about section, you can see this is Azure kernel. Now this kernel is dedicated gaming kernel. So because of this, you get maximum FPS in games, plus your day-to-day -day tasks are faster than ever. This handles all the Oxygen OS animation perfectly. Now let me show you what you get with this room. In the setting menu, you go to customization. There are plenty of preset themes. Plus, you get this McLaren Edition theme too. And if you don't like that, you can always customize different theme for yourself. And also in the wallpapers, you get all the wallpapers from OnePlus. And the reason this theme engine is different because you can customize your buttons too. You can change the way your button looks in your setting menu. But my personal favorite feature is this horizon light. So whenever you get new notification, this horizon light shows up on your lock screen and it looks really cool. This Android port comes with Gcam 7.4 pre-installed. And everything is working in Gcam, video recording, slow motion and night side too. And you also get inbuilt call recording feature that comes with OnePlus. So this is outstanding gaming room is completely stable. There is no bug. You get dedicated gaming kernel pre-installed and the battery life is good too. With my usage, I got eight hours of screen on time. So the software is working properly with my phone and all the OnePlus gestures are working great. In fact, I just came from Android 11 room and these gestures are even better than stock Android 11. It looks like MIUI, but it's different. Like when you install some custom rooms, you feel like this is unfinished product. But this OS looks solid and you can trust for stability. Personally, I feel Oxygen OS is really superior than some custom rooms in terms of features and smoothness. Also, this OnePlus launcher is great. It's definitely better than Pixel Launcher. Here you can disable or enable app drawer. You can have notification dots. And of course, this hidden space is part of Oxygen OS launcher, which makes it great. And as you can see in the Play Store, my Play Store is certified. It means even Google is unable to tell that I'm running custom port of official Oxygen OS. So even though this is perfect ROM, there is one tiny feature which is not working. Quick launching your payment app by long pressing your fingerprint. Because I have physical fingerprint, that feature is unavailable on my Redmi Note 7 Pro. If you're using any other phone, it might be available for you. The RAM management is outstanding, app opening time is faster, 
and now i'll show you how to install these on your phone so first of all download these three files from description box below now you can use any recovery you want i'm using orange fox so once you go to recovery wipe everything except internal storage and then first install the latest firmware then this oxygen os rom file and this fcap disabler make sure you install these three files otherwise your phone won't boot once you install them the first boot will take around 5 to 10 minutes like this video if you appreciate my work on this channel and i will see you tomorrow